Hi guys, Lynette with the Red Carpet Report. We are at the Directors Guild for the LA Asian Pacific Film Festival. Asian Pacific Film Festival, woo woo! So many celebrities have come out and it's Linsanity literally here. So come on, let's go check it out. Festival? No, I've, I've, I've been here a number of times. I mean, this is a, a great opportunity for us to come together and, and, and celebrate our community and, and you know, we, we've got a lot of talented people in this community. I see that. Making some, some really terrific uh, content. and. You know, tonight, opening with Linsanity, I, I got a chance to see the film uh, when I was in Hawaii last month, and uh, it's a great film. And it, it brought me right back to that time when, when all the crazy Linsanity was happening, and it's, it's so inspiring, you know, and I think it's a story that, that everybody can relate to. It's an underdog story, you know, whether you're Asian, white, black, whatever, you can relate to it, and, and, and I hope uh, everybody gets a chance to see it. Now, did you know that Jeremy Lin was such a huge role, role model worldwide? Because his story resonates with so many people. It, it, absolutely. I mean, I, I, it's no surprise. I mean, he's inspired me. I remember when all of this was happening. I, I, uh, I just it, it felt it it kind of it impacted me at my core, you know. And and as an Asian American, you know, working in an industry where you have to deal with adversity all the time, I could relate to what he's gone through. And um, and I'm just—I couldn't be happier for, for the success that he's had, and 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 the the, um, you know, the road that he's paving for for a lot of other, you know, young Asian Americans, you know, going up, trying to make something of themselves. Yeah. Now you've kind of had some longevity in the industry yourself. What advice would you give all up-and-coming actors? Work harder than the next guy, and and be patient, and and if and if you remember, you know, to to just always. Do your best in, 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 in the things that you can control. Um, then you should be able to rest uh, peacefully at night and, and, and remain hopeful, you know? It's, it's, it's a journey, you know? It's yes, it is! So wh where can we see you next? What are you working on? I just wrapped uh, season three of Hawaii Five O, so I'll be appearing in the last two episodes of season three. And then I'm about to, uh, to film a new pilot for uh, Stephen Bochco and TNT in June. You seem like you would have other stories to tell. Do you ever think of like directing, producing, writing yourself? I do. Uh, I think that's that'll be the natural evolution of things. Um, and I'm, I'm working on a, a couple things um, in my free time right now. And, and I, yeah, I, I just I'd love to tell stories that uh, specifically Asian American stories that that we don't see enough of outside of uh, environments like this. You know, hopefully we can make some content that reaches the rest of the world, everybody. Because here's the thing, at the end of the day, we're all the same, we struggle with the same things, and we have the same type of beliefs, right? And it's just about loving each other. Absolutely, yeah. Perfect, well enjoy your night. Thank, Thank you. you. Appreciate Thanks. you, you too. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe to our page. No, really, like and subscribe. Give me the ball. Bye guys.